Hello everyone. What you can see me dishing out is spicy corned beef omelette, which I made with tomato, pepper, onions, corned beef, and some different spices. So this is something that we normally eat on a Sunday. We normally eat it with yam. So if you want to see how I made it, please continue watching. Hello guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Efe and this is my kitchen, Efe's food kitchen. In today's video, I am going to be making a simple, quick recipe of boiled yams and spicy corned beef omelettes. So in front of you is the yam, that's the yam, the onions, the corned beef, the salt, 14 spices. I'm just going to be using a tiny bit of that because I don't want to overwhelm the egg. Then I'm going to be using three fresh tomatoes and two scotch bonnet pepper. And last but not least, I am using four eggs. I already put the oil that I'm going to use in the frying pan. So without further ado, let's get started. So the first thing I am going to do is wash the yam because obviously it's full of sand and dust. So I'm going to wash the surface of the yam and then peel it and then later on after it's peeled and washed and cut then um i'll be straight back see, i have washed the yam and sliced it as you can see that's the size that i'm going for i'm going for this shape so i'm gonna be putting it putting some hot water that i boiled into this pot And I'm going to add some salt. Just add according to your taste. I don't really like telling people, oh, this is what you should add. Add this much, add that much. You know, there are some people that do not even take salt. So you can't really say, add this much, add that much. Just add according to your taste. But as long as it's not too salty. So that's enough. So now I am going to boil it until it's soft. And then next thing I will do, I will start cutting the tomatoes, pepper, and the onions. So that's the yam. So I'm going to be switching that on. So now I'm just going to leave that to do its thing. Then I'll be back to check it later on. So now I am going to cut the onions. So that's it. So I'm gonna put that in there. Next, I'm going to cut the tomatoes. So I have chopped the onions, as you can see. I'm just gonna put it inside this bowl. So the onions have been chopped, it's in this bowl. Next thing I'm going to do is chop the tomatoes. I'm making spicy omelette. I like cutting my tomatoes a bit big. I don't like it so tiny. I like it so you can see the tomatoes as well. So the next is the pepper. I'm going to cut the pepper. So 
that's it. The tomatoes, the pepper, and the onions. So now I'm going to break my eggs. I decided to add two more eggs because I noticed four is not enough. So I added two, so it's six eggs. I'm using six eggs now. As opposed to four. So that's the eggs. I've finished cracking all the eggs. So what I'm going to do, I'm I don't know. I don't know about anyone else, but I always tend to add a little bit of milk into my eggs. So this is a teaspoon. And I'm using semi-skimmed milk. Then I'm gonna add my salt. Then I'm gonna do that to mix. See, all the yolks are broken down and all mixed together. And that's it. So the eggs have been broken and whisked. The onions, pepper, and uh, tomatoes have been done. So what is left now is the corned beef, which I'm going to open and put inside this bowl. So I'm going to open the corned beef now. It normally comes with a key like this that you can use so it makes it easier for you so you just slot the key in here it always has a hole and then you just you just start see so it will help you open it but if it doesn't come with the key by all means you can use a can opener to open it so that's the combit is open I'm just going to be using half of it. And then the next, the half, I'm going to put in this. So that's the corned beef. That's the one that I'm going to be using. That's half, and that's the rest half, which I'm covering with plastic wrap, which I will use another time. So let's get to the stove to cook. So let's check on our yam. As you can see, it's cooked because the knife goes in very easily. So I'm going to be switching that off. And then we are going to fry our omelets. So I'm going to start frying. I have some oil in this pan. I'm just going to let it get hot. And I'm going to put my onion, tomato, pepper. Let it cook before putting the corned beef and then finally the egg and mix them all together. Yes, so I'm going to add the onion. I'm going to cook it till it's soft. So I put in the the pepper and the tomato. I'm going to turn down the fire. So I'm cooking on medium heat now. The next thing I'm going to do is add in the cooking spices. Just a tiny bit, not too much. Just a little, just to give it a bit of nice taste. So it won't be bland. You know me already. I like my spice. You have to have a nice taste. Definitely. Let me 
Okay, so, so. From this already has four. We don't really put too much. So I'm just gonna put this much. The last thing you want is to over salt your food because once you, you put the salt, you can't really take it out. So as you can see, the onions, the pepper and tomato doing really nicely. I added um, some spice, which is this. I just added like half a teaspoon just to give it a bit of taste. The next thing I'm going to do is add my corn leaf. I'm just breaking it down a bit before mixing it into the mixture. So this is spicy corn beef omelette. If you didn't want to use corn beef, you can use tuna. You can use anything you like. It's up to you. You can use ham. Or if you want to make it a chicken uh, omelette, you can use some cut chicken. So it's the choice is entirely up to you. But this is how we like to eat. And we normally eat it with yam. You can eat it with rice as well. Now I'm going to put in the egg. I'm going to turn it down. I don't want it to burn. So I'm going to, what I'm doing, I'm just making so everything can go, so all the raw egg can go to the bottom, so everywhere can cook together. I'm going to turn and um, mix it, but I'm, I'm just waiting for the egg to set a bit. I'm just going to give that a couple of minutes, like one minute exactly, or one and a half minutes. So now I am going to turn it so the other side can cook as well. I don't want to eat raw egg. I don't want salmonella. So I'm going to let this cook as well for another one to two minutes and I'll be switching it up. It's cooking on very low heat, the lowest heat thing, the lowest heat ever. And then after, I'm going to be taking it off. So it's ready. So I'm going to be switching that off now. See, it's cooked on both sides. So I'm going to put in some of the omelette on this side. Next, I'm going to put the yam. I think I'm going to put one more so to fill up the plates.
and that's the food guys the boiled yam with the spicy corned beef omelette with tomato pepper onions and some little spices so that is it guys that's the food which we are all going to eat soon but let me just taste the omelette for you guys so you guys can see Mm. the corned beef gave it a really nice taste and the spice is not too much but it's just okay so guys if you like this video please give your girl a big thumbs up like comment subscribe and i'll see you in my next video bye but first let me lift it up so you can have a close look i bet you guys are hungry now i'm sure you are going to rush to the market to go and buy yam and egg and corn beef <laughs> all right take care thanks for stopping by guys bye